Yo, what's going on, guys? So we are coming in with the heat. The minute I actually post something, I get nowhere. So <laughs> I don't know anymore. Yeah, they get stressed. But anyway, guys, I'm coming to the point in my life that I'm starting to realize no one gives a fuck about you unless you got money or you born rich or just born into something or inherited something I didn't inherit shit literally all I inherited was a whole bunch of fucking bullshit ass people telling me I'm the fucking golden child I'm too spoiled I get everything handed to me just a lot of bullshit that has been going on in the past few years with my life you know to this point in my YouTube career I'm getting ready to quit Literally, I'm, I'm tired. Like, your boy is struggling. I'm tired, boss, for real. Like, I don't know what to do. Literally, I'm struggling. So, I've been promoting, but it seems like it's not working like it's supposed to. Like, literally. So, I'm moving to a different channel. It's called Elijah the Gamer Code 3 Films. In parentheses. Sorry, I can't talk. But literally, guys, I want to thank you guys for watching on this channel. If you really, really like this channel, give it some love. Like, literally, fill me in on your life. Like, tell me you love me or something. Because, boy, he, he needs some love too, okay? So, with that being said, guys, I'll be posting a video on my Cold 3 Films channel. Probably today, later, probably within the day. Because the lights on that car are hella bright and I don't want to attract no neighbors. So... I want to thank you guys. Oh, yeah. By the way, this dude knocked on my door. I didn't know who he was or what he was doing. I thought it was that Jehovah Witness or, you know, the other people that come to your door and talk about God. Don't get me wrong. I do believe in God. I'm a Christian. Okay. I, I stay prayed up. But thing is, I'm a schizophrenic. So my faith is kind of shaky. You know, I, I believe, but then I just. I don't have answers, you know, like, it's like I hear these voices and I hear these negative things about my life and I, everything that's happening to me lately is so late, so crazy because I got into a wreck. Okay. I wrecked my mom's 2021 Buick Encore and the thing is she was supposed to pass that car down to me and yet I crashed it and it got totaled. So thing is when I got into the wreck. I snapped back into reality and I didn't realize I even got into a wreck. Like, fucking hell. God, thank you. Sometimes I do things and don't realize it. You know, I kind of black things out and kind of break off into my own little world. Like, I don't know. Last thing I remember is going down the street and going into this zone of just confusion and. Everything just went numb like and then next thing I know I wake up and I'm pushed back and hit um, Nordler Nordler's or whatever the car dealership is called And I hit one of their f-150s luckily The off pe the people there are said that I'm hella lucky that I ain't hurt nobody or end up killing myself because literally whatever it was that caused that I could have been dead or someone else could have been seriously injured and I would be in jail for some homicide attempt. But literally, I, I don't know. So sometimes I just think you got to be real with the shit. So I, I, I'm going to stop bullshitting and say the truth. Just be you. Don't try to do anything you see other people doing. You know, it's okay to study other content creators. Like my, I was just watching my boy Afro. On Twitch and he was talking about you know well mainly he was bullshitting because somebody called herself pebbles or whatever I don't know but literally sometimes it should it takes effort and to be a good YouTube creator you have to have backbone and you have to have the fans and you have to have the you know watch time to actually get somewhere you know if you're not born into this shit or inherited shit like this or have some patent then you're not gonna make it, okay? So that, that's my that's my advice to the people. If you're not willing to put in the work and willing to stay on beat with what you're doing, 
you're going to be gone. You're literally going to be struggling. Like, you might get the thousand subscribers. You might get the views. But you won't get the comments. You won't get the engagement. Like, literally, that's my problem. I got the watch time. And I got the subscribers. I just don't got the backbone to keep doing it. Sometimes I feel so on top of the world that I can tear up a bush. Tear up, like, tear the freaking White House down if I really want to. If you want to go into politics. Like, fuck politics, by the way. Literally, guys. Just be real for who you are. Be you if you're a YouTube creator. Don't worry about all the other shit. It's okay to study other content creators and feed off of them and do what they're doing. But real shit, guys. Just, you gotta be you. I'm sorry that I hurt anybody's feelings by saying all this shit, but sometimes you just gotta have strength for yourself. Do for yourself. You know, if you got a fiance or girlfriend or a boyfriend or a male, female, male on male, female on female, dog on dog, you know, I don't care. Literally, focus on what you want your life to be like. You can't just wake up and get on the computer or get on whatever device you have and call yourself famous. This shit takes effort. Like, literally, it's not easy. Like, fuck it. Literally, I, I cried myself to sleep so many different times trying to do this shit. Literally, I I'm putting myself in, in a bad position, a depression. And this shit is eating me up, literally. I'm trying my hardest to perform these videos and get somewhere. I'm tired of my life. Like, literally, I want it to be better. So that's why I'm working so hard to get somewhere with my life. Even if it means having to sacrifice my life away. Not so much as killing myself. No, I ain't gonna do it. But literally, what I mean, sacrifice my life as in put things or other things off that really will make a bigger impact on stuff. So, as I'm saying, guys, you guys just stay tuned for more. Thanks for watching, everybody. And stay tuned for the Code 3 films. I'll leave the somewhere around here you'll see it just click on it and subscribe but with that being said guys that's the truth about me everyone stay tuned for more thank you peace motherfuckers